Be wary, my son. Heed these words, for the fires of our past grow dim. From humble beginnings, a village became a nation, an empire. As clashing ambition spurred the appetite of armies, plow and sickle gave way to sword and shield. Consumed by war, mankind found their results, rushing to action on impulse without forethought. Religious devotion brought hope to some. But even then, many were consumed by zealotry, filling them with suspicion and fear. From this darkness, a glimmer of light emerged. A muse from ancient times long forgotten inspired great minds and ushered in a rebirth of art and science. As unanswered questions from the past found new illumination in a renewed thirst for knowledge, revelations from above provided insights below, spurring new advances throughout the world, bringing an end to one way of life giving rise to another, leading brave souls to reach for the ends of the world and beyond. You must tread carefully, my son, for their charge now lies with you. Choose their path and guide your people through these ever-changing times. Alright, welcome to episode one! I am so excited to start this playthrough, because I just saw the intro, or actually you just saw the intro too, and it was awesome! Oh my gosh, I'm going to lead my people. I'm going to lead my people. I'm excited, this is, this is exciting. Okay, okay, okay. Without further ado, let us start. Set up game. Alright, so. I ain't gonna be some random leader. No. Let's see what we have. We have what's the new new ones? Are they in alphabetical order? Or... Yeah, they're in alphabetical. So William's new. She looks new. Yeah, she's new. Mm, I don't know. I forgot who's new. Okay, I kind of want to play someone new. She's new. Austria. Uh, he's new. Um, Sweden, Mongolia. He's new. I think he's new. She's new. I think she's new. Oh, she's new. There's a lot of new civilizations with this new DLC. Yeah, if you haven't picked it up, it was really cheap in the sale, but now the sale's over, so sorry. If you didn't pick it up, then it's not good. But uh, I think what I want to do is to be American. Because I'm an American. Yeah. That or German. Now nah, let's do this. Won't be so good uh, for the very beginning. But what can you do? Okay, so advanced setup. Let's see. What do we want to do? I don't, I don't like doing like these like standard maps like Americas or anything. Like that. I like new places, like new stuff that looks cool. I guess continents would be fine. Let's do that. Map size would be six players. I always like doing standard. Let's do standard. Give uh, difficulty. Let's do prints. I ain't so good. <laughs> game pace, standard, uh, game era. Let's just start all information age. Era. Isn't that new? I don't know. I hope so. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Uh, let's do temperate. That's good. Normal, sea level, medium, standard. Uh, victory types. I don't like anyone winning. 
I just like playing and seeing how it goes. Yeah, let's just do that. Um, I do like complete kills. So like, if you destroy the last city, they can still get away with like a some sort of mini unit, like a what is it? Settler, I think. I'm not sure. Um, Hmm. Let me see the text. Oh, I gotta start a timer. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna have 15 minute episodes. And we've been here for. Eh, let's, uh. Let's do 10 minutes more. Ooh, not 10 hours, 10 minutes. Alright, start! Alright, 10 minutes to do something awesome. Okay, uh. Da -da -da, that's good. Let's edit this. Alright, my leader name shall be the Red Leader. The Red Theater. <laughs> Can you this game out? Civilization name. Shove boy game. Oops. Civilization short. Shove boy. Civilization adjective. American. Uh, Sheboygan would be fine. Nee. Let's be a Sheboygan height. <laughs> Good, except we are the leader of the Sheboygans. Wait a second. Something's not right. Let's cancel this. America. Okay, okay. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Okay, that makes sense. Alright, so the red leader civilization name will be the Shaboy Again, Empire. Oh, never not. <laughs> Sheboygan Empire? Oh. Hmm. Sheboygan Red. <laughs> okay, it's fine. Uh, short shall be Sheboygan. That doesn't make any sense. Sheboygan clan. There we go. Boom. Sheboygan adjective. A Sheboygan knight. There. Done. No spellings. Accept. All right. So all these gonna be random AI. Blah blah blah. All right. Let's do this. Start game. All right. Episode one. Y'all excited? I am. Oh. You lead the industrious American civilization. Formed in the conflagration of revolution in the 18th century, within a hundred years, the young nation became embroiled in a terrible civil war that nearly tore the country apart. But it was just a few short years later, in the 20th century, that the United States reached the height of its power, emerging triumphant and mighty from the two terrible wars that destroyed so many other great nations. The United States is a nation of immigrants, filled with optimism and determination. They lack only a leader to help them fulfill their promise. President Washington, can you lead the American people to greatness? Can you build a civilization that will stand the test of time? It's President Sheboygan, thank you. Not Washington. <laughs> what? What is this? No. Did it not save that at all? If it didn't, I'm, I'm upset. Demographics, come on, come on, what am I? What am I? I yes, Here is thank you. Oh my goodness. Consider I sending your warrior out to explore new territory. I, I, thank you, thank you. But um, I've played this game for 80 hours. No, stop it. Okay, uh, but I'm a little rusty, thank you, thank you. Religion. I have some information that may be of use. Yes, you do. I need ten faith to. Oh, this is gonna be cool. I'm excited. Okay. Um. But what am I? Okay. Good. 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 I don't know. That doesn't make. That doesn't really. 
That doesn't really matter that much, but it does to me. Ah, oh, man, I'm gonna have to reach around my mic to do this. Ah, oh, dumb. Right. Okay, phone. Okay. All right, so, my settlers, the Shaborganites. Where shall we settle? Okay, um, a few things are missing. You, you. Eh, hide recommendations. I can do this. I think I want to settle. Let's move my warriors right here. I think this valley right here. But if I settle here, I'll get marble, cows, all that sweet stuff. Okay. Next. Thank you. Next turn. I'm really excited about learning about uh, this religion thing. Because I don't know, I just love, I like. You should found your city soon. Oh, yes. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, I gotta turn that off. <laughs> Uh, I'm not. No advice. Oh, new to the expansion. There we go. There we go. There we go. Okay. Um. But like, I love seeing like religion in games. Like I don't like like people bashing the religion, but like having like different religions and you can like see like what your civilization religion is and then see how your religion spreads. Like I did that in Civ for like all the time. Like it was. That's what I did like most of the time. I just did that. I didn't really care for anything else. <laughs> uh, let's go with uh, husbandry for now, because we can get uh, you and you. Oh, wait, no. We need a uh, something. <laughs> Hunting grounds or something like that. Uh, marble will come much later, I think. Grab that. A map. Darn. Oh, hey, Columbo. That's new. Mmm, I'm excited. <laughs> It's been a while since I played this game. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Faith. So, I gotta find something that will increase my faith. And we'll get that going. Okay, so there's a barbarian village right there. Let's keep going this way. There you are. We would get crushed. We get up to that mountain and just kind of chill there for a while and see. We can rain upon them. Yeah, keep going. Oh. Persia. I've had bad experiences with you before. <laughs> How nice to meet you. Goodbye. <laughs> oh, you're in my way. Rio de Janeiro. Oh, they just gave me 15 gold. I love you guys. I love you. Okay, my My people are happy, good. Washington, Psh, heck no. This shitty, <laughs> whoa, this, this city, <laughs> my bad, shall be Sheboygan. No, I'm not, exclamation point. Okay, so the new town of Sheboygan, that'll be my capital. It's gotta be Sheboygan, I mean, come on. All right, warriors, position yourself for battle. I have some information that may be of use. Okay, so this, I think this is all new, hopefully. Okay, zone of control. Our unit is within enemy's zone of control. This means that when you move from one tile next to an enemy, the unit will say that will consume all movement for that turn. Oh. Okay. So... If I'm just passing through here, like if this is going to take two moves, I'd get in this space and it'd take all my turn, like all my movement. So I have to go one space at a time. Hmm. That kind of sucks. Oops. So, attack orders generally. Okay, cool. Alright, that's, that's new. Thank you. Hmm, man. Combat's gotten harder, too. They are fortified, so... Let's let's just chill here. And, uh... How we fortify... Oh, Sheboygan builds that monument. Hmm. Trapping, that's it. <laughs> and then this is animal husbandry. Yeah, animal husbandry down there. Mining, masonry... What is going on? Why are we waiting so much? 
Yeah, let's just keep going. <laughs> You've had your fun. Move along. So barbarians are harder to take out now. That's kind of, that's kind of cool. Sheboygan has grown. Huzzah! Oh, old faithful. Hey, hey, cool. And Columbo, and they just gave me gold. Thank you, Columbo. Columbo. There's old faithful with science. Okay, next turn. It's a beautiful um, gibberish you're speaking there. Neutral. I am D <laughs> Didu. I am Didu, Queen of Carthage, and all of her holdings. Goodbye. Goodbye, weird lady. Oh no! Well, that concludes the first episode, or the uh, intro to Civilization Five: Gods and Kings. Thank you for watching episode one. Please stay tuned for episode two coming soon. I am Red Leader Fourteen. Thanks again for watching. God bless. And latest episode one complete. Landed like shaft for Latinos and blacks Packing them straps and Caucasians Hooked on ecstasy in the crack Stack the sins of this world to his body And conquer evil and hell And stacks the keys of death And one to breath and unlock the Go. cell He rolls on a third I'm telling you find a residual fact Just like Toby Mac and Pony Soprano upon his track We slam dunking and keep it jumping Like jumper cables And keep the crowd rowdy like Jesus It's like